What is going on YouTube? What is going on fellow entrepreneurs? All right, today's video is going to be the silence breaker. I know things have been kind of quiet lately. Um, there's been some things going on, nothing all too crazy serious. Um, but I'll let you know that, you know, we had a family member go into the hospital. They've been there for a couple weeks and um, uh, they're, they're getting better, you know, and um, saw so, some stuff with me too as well. Um, I'm actually, I'm actually dealing with the fact that I'm actually losing my hearing and um, I'll be going to, um, I got to make an appointment at the uh, VA, VA hospital, local VA hospital um, to get a, to get an appointment to see a audio special, audio specialist, one of those, an ear person, I don't know the exact name, but um, yeah, it's, it's come to my attention and everyone else's attention that I'm actually losing my hearing. So I've been dealing with that. It's not the worst. You know, there's some answers and everything, but it is a thing. Uh, but that's not the only thing that's been going on. There's been some stuff going on in vending paradise, okay? Vending machine paradise, okay? So you guys know that I have uh, two locations. The first one is the temp job location where people go to get temporary jobs because they're unemployed so they can make some money. Um, and the second location is the water uh, field station where they manage um, water and all that stuff in the area. So there's been some stuff that's been understandable, some complaints, and some of that are understandable, some that um, could have been dealt with ahead of time with some uh, proper explanation. So we're going to go off with the first location. Um, some issues with, there's some issue with both machines. Um, and... The, first, the, the snack machine is one that needed some proper explanation. The, um, the people, whoever was using the machine, wanted to use the machine, whenever they're making their selections, they're just tapping on the selection. And I don't know if that's just my machine or this, that, that model, um, but I, from what I do is you have to hold the select, the selecting, selector button, you know, like B6, A8, whatever, CC and hold it until if it completely spins and releases a lot of them are just tapping it and expecting it to release and if you wait too long I'm pretty sure it just resets so that was one of the complaints I was getting um, so I went there restocked the machine and I bought like 10 items in front of the at least the employees there because you gotta take care of the employees I bought 10 items at random just and each time Show them, hey, you got to hold the items. So if it continues, I'm going to make a little memo card on there that you just tape on there. And so that people can be like, okay, that way I don't, you know, lose any money on there. At least it's explained. Um, so that's that's the, with that machine. So at the same location, the drink machine, um, I've actually been having a hard time finding a proper maintenance person to help me out, or like a vending maintenance um, I found one guy online on OfferUp, but it turns out he's kind of flaky. Um, I would tell him the days that I was free, the times that I was free, and um, say, hey, give me a heads up and everything. So there'd be days where say, okay, I can go see you this time. I'm like, cool. Um, I say, hey, you know, I'm waiting. He's like, oh, he doesn't show up. I don't even get a response. So then, like, the next day, same guy is like, hey. I'm on your side of town right now. And I'm like, hey, you didn't give me a heads up. So that's the end of that. I needed that guy to help me on my drink machine. Uh, because I have like one slot that is not holding any drinks at all. Literally just put the drinks in there. It just falls right through. Um, I'm not a specialist on that stuff. So I don't know. Uh, another one where things, things are getting kind of jammed. And I don't know what's going on. So I kind of need some help with that. And I need to explain to the people that, hey, I'm trying to find a, you know, proper person that actually knows these things. Maybe they can give me a little heads up, you know, a little uh, bit of info. Maybe that I can actually fix it next time myself. Um, but I'm still looking. So, I, the, you know, a thought occurred to me. Maybe if I actually were to swap out the machine, but then I remember the machines are both on the same, same key. And I'm like, oh, man, I don't want to do that unless I just remove those machines and buy like a combo machine. But you guys also know that I've also been trying to save up money to buy a truck as well because I am 
I'm not without a vehicle. The wife, you know, she works at her job. She takes the vehicle, and I do things here. And I want to. I'm saving for not only to buy more machines, and locations, and stuff, but also a a truck to you know do my things with because uh, in case I see some awesome deal with a vending machine somewhere, I can you know get a trailer and then you know take care of it myself instead of getting a big old truck, rent it, and do all that stuff. I kind of want to, you know, do it myself. So that's what's going on with the first location and what I'm trying to accomplish, you know. And in the second location, it's just the drink. All right, I have a snack and a drink side by side. And the drink machine, they were actually getting, I was actually getting some complaints saying, hey, you know, if it, does, if it doesn't stop taking my money, uh, you know, we're going to have some issues here. And I'm like, whoa, 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 whoa. Last thing I want is to lose that location. So I go back there and um, it's in an employee break room where they all sit down to eat. And it's right there, right next to the door. And um, there's, they're, they're coming in and out and they're like, oh, look, the vending guy's here. And I'm like, yeah, I'm here. I, um, so what's going on? What's the machine doing? And they're like, yeah, it's taking our money. I'm like, okay, so what's what's uh, the issue? Like, how is it taking your money? Everything it just is even giving you anything? And it turns out that it was just the Mountain Dew selection out of the eight that was not working. So there's there's Coca Cola, there's Pepsi, there's um, Sprite, diet stuff, and um, I'm like, okay. So the complaints were about the Mountain Dew not working it was so bad that they were just like to the point that we want a different machine and i'm like so what i'm gonna do later on this week when i get a chance is to go to the location actually swap the stickers out uh for the less desired i think there's like a sun-kissed um grape or orange in there swap that with the mountain dew have the mountain dew work and in the meantime until i find someone that can actually help me with the mountain dew and my other location. So that's what's going on. You know, you know, I'm writing these the success of these two locations to help push me forward, along with some other things I'm doing on the side to keep me afloat and moving along, you know. So I need these two locations. Last thing I want is to lose them, but one for reasons that were easily explained, two for, you know, hey, I'm actually trying. I hope they understand, you know, that when they see me switch this stuff around so they can get the product that they so desire. Mountain Dew. It's delicious. I know, right? So, that's what's been going on, guys. Um, I hope you guys aren't too upset about the... Uh, usually, I try to pump out a video, like, at least once a week, you know? I'm not the crazy YouTuber uh, that I want to be, eventually. Uh, but, yeah, once a week. I know it's been over over two weeks. But, hey, life is life. I hope you guys understand that. And to everyone that's been, you know, subscribing, we broke over... We're at 400 subscribers now. Thank you. I really appreciate that. I hope you guys have been watching the videos in the meantime and everything. And with this one, get caught up on what's going on. Um, there is actually a deal that I have coming up with a that I'm going to work with. See if it actually happens. Um, I'm not telling you what it is. Not like a sponsorship. No way. I'm talking about like possible possible offer for a machine and stuff like that. I, I got to see what's going on. Um, and I will definitely uh, record that experience if it's a uh you know green light if everything's good to go and uh but yeah if you guys like my channel you watch this video and you haven't subscribed yet please subscribe for everyone that's been sticking around appreciate the love and support you guys have given the channel um i hope it continues to grow i really really appreciate every single one of you thank you for getting me to 400 subscribers um i will see you guys in the next video take it easy stay safe and i'll see you guys later